again, this is Robert Veach here, and this is my video review of the Aircast Air Select Walker Brace or Walking Boot. This is the large size. This is the Elite version, the short. The short is the overall height of it. There is the long version, which is longer. Now, um, this thing has some unique features on it. It has a durable, semi-rigid shell, which you can see right here. It looks really high-tech. Looks like something a Stormtrooper would be wearing in Star Wars. Very nice quality. It has, uh, it protects your leg, this plastic, and holds you very rigid so that your joint right here doesn't flex. It, um, these are overlapping pieces of plastic. Inside there's pneumatic compression, um, uh, ports in there that we're going to show that you could increase the pressure and there's a release valve right there and a pressure valve right there it's an open frame design you can see these openings right here and along here and on the top and that allows airflow to go into your foot so that your foot doesn't overheat which is really important for wound healing if you're diabetic like me it's important for healing of your diabetic wounds and stuff um, the bottom of this is very nice and looking at the profile you can see that it's tapered up just the right amount has a flat part and tapered up on the front and when you walk on this it kind of keeps you walking on your heel which is what you want to keep pressure off your foot right here and if you look at the bottom of this it's really high-tech looking uh, different colors and very very non-slip very rugged I really like it. Now going over these valves that are on here, there is a little porthole right there. And when you push the valve, you don't want to push it on the side, you want to cover that porthole just like that. And then let it breathe, push like that. Now inside here I'm going to show you, There's, I'm going to give show you a demonstration video of how to put this on. Um, it's from the company and you can see further how to do that, but I'm going to show you right here. You take the Velcro off so we can get to the inside of this. I'm going to show you the ports on here so you get an idea of how they operate. So I'm going to take the boot plastic off and you can see this outer shell right here. This is the outer shell. Very nice quality. It has some foam, almost feels like memory foam, behind a nice fiber material right there. Now, if you look at the inside of this, let's open up the inside right here so we can gain access to this part right here. So, on each one of the sides, you see this clear looking bag. That bag is filled with air. And as I expand this, can almost hear it filling up. This is now expanding just like a balloon. And to release the pressure, you just push this little button right here. And you can hear the pressure coming out of there. After you have this pumped up and you want to remove the shoe, you should release the pressure on both sides so that you're starting off with no pressure. Now it's important that you do plug that little hole when you do push this, just like that. Don't do it like that because it won't be effective. Just go like that and it will work perfect for you. And then you have to release right there. So now I'm going to show that video from the manufacturer of how you actually put this shoe on. Now this is also universal design and it's lightweight. Even though it looks big, it's actually lightweight, and this is the large size. So, I wanted to show you that, the top and the bottom. There's a strip of Velcro right there. And once you get your leg in there, that Velcro will attach to this right here and become very strong, holding you in place, your foot in place. And the same thing on this side right here. You have the soft material, and you just fold it over like that, and then the Velcro attaches. And on the bottom of this shoe is a rubberized material. 
it's soft but not too soft because you want to get some support and your foot will eventually form a memory inside there and cradle your foot even better once you wear the shoe for like maybe a week and a half or so so that's that's a nice design all open air to keep your foot nice and cool while you're walking after wearing this for a week i'll tell you what i think i like it just don't over pressurize it because you have to get used to that because it's going to put some pressure on your calves so be conservative with that till you get used to it but in terms of the stability that this gives you it works really well i'm type 2 diabetic and i have a foot ulcer right now on the bottom of my foot and this is helping me to get that pressure off that foot so that that diabetic ulcer could heal so i really think this is a great product a great value at amazon and I'm going to give it a full five-star rating on my channel. Please hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you're alerted to new video uploads. I hope this video view helped you with your buying decisions. Thanks for watching.